Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl, this guy's on. If you're first time here, hey, don't make it your last time. Now, we're going to uh, examine these here songs, R. Kelly and the Isley Brothers. We want to find out, A, is this music stolen, borrowed, or paid for? You know what the history of the Isley, we just don't know. We got to be careful. <laughs> We're not insinuating anything. We're simply asking a question, okay? That's it. Guys, listen to these two songs. Well, listen to these two artists and listen to, <laughs> just check out the footage. That's all I'm saying. Just check it out. This is not a coincidence right after the damn verses. This song was dropped less than 24 hours after the verses. Check it out. Break off the food and the drinks. It's going to be a party. Turn up the music real loud. Invite everybody. See what I'm talking about now. Somebody gonna have to explain this right here. And now, put down in the comments what R. Kelly songs do you hear? I hear Happy People, Step in the Name of Love, um, Backyard Party, and uh, that other one too, off of that old album, the older album with him, you know, button with the, the button down shirt, uh, Heaven Girl. Oh, uh, god, I can't think of the name of it, but you know what I'm talking about, okay? I'm having a senior moment on my goddamn video. Anyway, drop down in the comment section what songs did you feel that they, uh, <laughs> that R. Kelly made this song off of? Because clearly they stole R. Kelly's music, clearly, and remixed it. Who's behind this lynch mob? 